trying to find a light. Hold on. Because I need the light. So, what's up, y'all? Um, what's today? It's Tuesday, the 15th. And it's my baby birthday. So, right now, we're at, we're checking into our hotel. We got a hotel right across from the mall. Um, he's checking us in right now. And after he checks us in, we're going to get food. I don't know what I'm gonna eat yet because I'm just like gonna eat something until later. I really don't know what we're doing today, guys. So let me tell you, I've been asking him for like probably a week or two straight. Like I've been asking him for a week or two straight. Um, Hold on y'all, the sun went away. But yeah, like I was saying, so I've been asking him for like a week or two straight. What do he want to do for his birthday? And he have not been saying nothing at all. He's like, oh, I don't really celebrate my birthday. I'm humble, this and this and that. And I'm like, but it's your birthday. So I'm just like, I've been asking him, but he has not really been saying anything to me. So I'm just kind of like, I really don't know what we're doing today. Like, I don't know what we have planned. I don't know what to dress for. Like right now I got on this like cute little top, y'all. It, it ain't holding up, like, but I got on this cute little top and some ripped jeans. Um, and I like, I brought other stuff with me. Like I brought like this really sexy dress from Passionola. Um, I really keep looking up, not paying attention, y'all, because I'm trying to see when he gonna come out so I can, like, get the bags or whatever, help him get the bags. But, um, yeah, I really don't know, like, what we're doing today. So, while he's out, because he, once he checks in, oh, here he comes. Okay, y'all, I'ma just check in back. <laughs> I'ma just check back in with y'all when, when I get situated. <laughs> Hey guys, so let me just update y'all. So basically, last time I checked in with y'all, we had a room by the mall. They messed up our reservation, did some stupid stuff, whatever, whatever. So we just switched to a whole different room. Now we're like uptown area, center city. So I'm gonna give y'all a quick little room tour, whatever, whatever. I'm gonna show y'all the views we got and then I'm gonna let y'all know what's gonna go on. So this is the first view. I like the other view better, but it's the windows for me. It's the second one does. I like it. It's very pretty. Okay, so we got that over there. TV. This a couch. So this like the little living area space when you first walk in. Okay. And then you got the first bathroom. Well, it's only one bathroom, but this is the bathroom right here. Okay, period. And then you got this. This is why I booked this room. This is why I wanted this room just for this. Yes, I can't wait to get in that tonight. Okay, period, babe. Yes. So yeah, that's the room tour, y'all. Nothing major. Something little slight, little slight, little slight. So now, y'all, I'm about to just um, I just got some pizza from this place called Fuel Pizza and some fries. So I'm about to just eat right now. Um, when I'm done eating, I need to go to Walmart and go to Spencer's and grab a few things because. They don't know it yet, but I'm about to decorate the whole room. Like, I really, I'm like so nervous. Like, I don't know how his reaction is going to be. Um, He was like, we're not doing nothing today. I'm just so nonchalant. I'm humble, whatever. 
And I'm like, I want to at least get out and about. Or if you just really humble, then let's just chill tonight. Like, you know, so I'm about to go get some stuff so I can decorate the room. You know, I'm already taking y'all with me. About to eat this food. Um, other than that, I mean, I'll just be waiting on him because he just went to go like run around, get a few things done, um, get a shape up. And then he's going to like, you know, come wash, get dressed. And I'm just going to see what we're going to do from then because I really don't know. Like, I'm just stuck. But, you know, we just going to go with the flow, see how the day go by. So, yeah. And I'm going to just keep updating y'all along the way. So real quick, let me show y'all what I got from Fuel Pizza. So, I got some fries. I guess just regular season waffle fries. What the fuck? And then I got um some buffalo chicken. Buffalo chicken pizza, y'all. And that little stuff like right there, like that, I thought it was chicken and it's carrots. I didn't know the pizza came with carrots on it. I didn't know carrots was on it. I didn't even know they put carrots on it until they handed me the pizza and I got in the car and I looked at it. So, yeah. I mean, it's really actually good, but I'm just like, it took me for a surprise and then it's like too much crunch for me. But, yeah, y'all, this is what I got from Fuel Pizza. I ain't finna do nothing right now. So, y'all, I just called my Uber. I mean, not just called it, but they just texted me and said they'll be here in two minutes. So, I'm trying to hurry up and rush downstairs. I'm off the 12th floor. So, I'm trying to hurry up and rush downstairs. I really hate that I just came outside like this, but oh well. But yeah, I'm trying to hurry up and rush downstairs. So, by the time they get here, I can just be walking out the building and hop straight in the car. Yep. Let me just take y'all along the way, show y'all a little bit. Show y'all what I'm getting, what I got going on, all that good stuff. They say he's in a Toyota, Toyota Prius. I didn't even check the color. Don't talk to me. Damn, which way is he coming from? Y'all, I don't know. I'm about to just stand on the corner and see if he see me. But I just want to show y'all a little bit of downtown because I said I was going to try to get out and about. Yes, ma'am, the sun is what I was waiting for. Hit me. Yes, y'all. Let's see. Uh, uh. Yeah, so let me check to see where this freaking guy's at and then get back with y'all. Y'all, so I just got out the Uber. I just arrived at the mall. I'm at North Lake Mall. So I only want to go to like two or three stores. So I'm going to just show y'all when I get in here. I know exactly where they're at because I've been to this mall so many times. Like. Y'all probably like, her shoes is so annoying. I don't care. Shit. Y'all wanna go into this store. That's called Little Tiny Waist. Hi. 
Hi. This one I don't go to the mall because every time I go to the mall, I get more than one thing. What I'm supposed to come here for? I just, this is the store I literally meant to come into and then I freaking bought a waist trainer. Like what? <laughs> Hi. Ooh. Y'all, so since it's big birthday, I wanna get like, a lot of sex things like um what's it called like games i came in a specific store for some throat spray yes i said throat spray <laughs> but um i'm looking for just other like cute stuff sexy stuff <laughs> i don't know if she's laughing at me like Oh, here are all this stuff. So yeah, I'm at the, ooh, I wanna get a whip. Y'all, hey so I just left out of Spencer's. Right now, um, so the only reason I came to the mall was to go to Spencer's, was to go to that specific store. And I ended up buying a fucking waist trainer, like, what the fuck? <laughs> but I did need one, I just was like, you know, but I'm glad that I came because I would've just been off putting it more and more, like, you know, don't work out, don't work out. So, oh, she told me not to take it off. I can't breathe in this shit, y'all. So, right now, um, I'm like, damn, I was only here like less than 30 minutes. I kind of don't want to go back and do what I want to do yet. So, my next stop was Walmart so I can get some candles and little stuff like that. And I'm going to show y'all what I got from Spencer's when I get back to the room. But that was my next stop walmart to get like little candles or whatever and i forgot they had a candle store in the mall so that's where i'm gonna go down to the candle store yeah it's down that side fuck i can't breathe in this shit y'all Then I had the nerve to put my top back on over it. Like, what the fuck? So, y'all, I went in Forever 21, too. Like, this is why I have to get the freak out of the mall because I'm gonna spend all my money here. So, basically, I just left out of Forever 21 and I called my Lyft. It's two minutes away, probably closer than that now. So I'm trying to hurry up and make it outside to them. Um, once I get in the car, I'll be on my way to Walmart to pick up. So I just bought candles here at the mall, but um, I'm going to Walmart to get fake candles and probably some better ones, cheaper ones. Um, what else? And some rose petals. And also a speaker because some of the hotel rooms in Charlotte has speakers built in the room but this one particularly particularly don't so I'm going to buy me just a little cheap speaker and some more candles and some rose petals so yeah the mall closing is getting dead so I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get in the car. Um, 
for me and Bay to drink out of. I'm looking for balloons, but like, how am I gonna blow these ones up? Like, I don't know. I'm looking for regular balloons too. <gasps> oh, excuse me. Specifically red and black, but like, what the hell? This the party section, but they don't got shit over here. They don't got shit over here at all. Like, what am I supposed to do? I'm not feeling this. Yeah, I'm really not feeling this. Like, uh-uh. I'm finna go, like, ask for some help or figure out what's going on because I need some help. So, yeah. We in Walmart, looking for some stuff. They don't even got nothing. This weak ass shit. All right, y'all, let me get this together so I can hurry and get out this store because I do not want to be in here no more longer. And I'm going to get back to y'all when I get back to the room. Okay, period. So basically, I just wasted my time and my money because Walmart didn't have what I was looking for, what I needed. So I'm going to have to go to a different Walmart or Target or whatever and find what I need. Y'all, when I say my feet hurt, my feet hurt. Like... I hate having to be rushed. I hate having responsibilities. Oh my God, like, I wanted to be grown so fucking fast. Now I'm like, I'm not feeling this. So let me just update y'all. Right now, I'm currently on my way out the door again. Um, I just ordered another Uber. It'll be here in like two, three minutes. Probably by the time I get downstairs, it'll be down there. So right now I'm on my way to Target to pick up the stuff that I couldn't find at Walmart. And I just called them ahead of time to confirm. Oh, I'm so tired. I still got on this waist trainer. So I called ahead of time to ask them if they had the stuff and everything that I asked for. Um, the men I guess services told me that they have. So that's good for me because they he literally just like everything that I've been asking for that I went to Walmart to look for. He told me that they um that they have so and target is only five minutes away like i felt so stupid i just literally went all the way to the other side of town literally all the way to the other side of town just to pick up a whole bunch of nothing like just to waste my money so now i'm on my way to target waiting for my uber to get here and then i'll be going to target um and Target is only five minutes away, so I did a round trip Uber, which is really good because, like I said, it's only hey, five minutes. Out, bro. Out, bro. Ew. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> okay, so, yeah. Okay, here's my Uber right here. I don't want to walk in the grass. So, yeah, y'all, I'm going to just update y'all when I get to Target. Yeah. Hi. All right. <sighs> uh, 
first? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna target in back. Okay. Um, I think I spoke with you. Oh. No. Maybe it's somebody at the service desk. This the service desk? Yeah. <sighs> I be getting so fucking aggravated, like. Y'all, look at the roses. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Oh my God, I can't wait. Okay, so I'm gonna get the roses last cause they're right there by the door. So he said, he said straight to the back to the birthday section. Where I'm going. Where the fuck is the birthday station? Okay, y'all, let me just figure this out first and then I'll be back. Y'all, I just got to the party section and I got balloons. Um, I got balloons now, it's just like I don't know. I got two 15 count bags, so hopefully, 30 should be enough. Um, yeah, 30 should be enough. Like, my mind, it just feels so scrambled. I just feel so scrambled. They don't have black, but they have red, so that's good. So I got two 15 bags, which is 30 in total. I think that 30 should be enough. So I got that. Um, Else. I'm just looking for like little small decorations and stuff, you guys. So, I got that out the way. So, I'm gonna just check back in with y'all when I just find a little bit of more stuff. Okay. So, guys, I just got back to my hotel from Target. When I say like my nerves are so bad, like. I've just been running around all day. I haven't got a chance to chill and sit down. So my feet are burning. Like they're killing me. A couple hours. It's just too much going on. Um, but all for my bae, like, I hope when he see this, he really appreciate it because, you know, I put a lot of thought into it. He said he wanted to be humble. He didn't want to do anything. So, you know, I put a lot of thought and money to it. I spent like $300 today. So, yeah, I just want to let him know that I appreciate him. <laughs> Sign out, y'all. But, yeah, so 
I ended up getting real roses because they didn't have rose petals, which is stupid. So I ended up getting real roses and I'ma just have to rip them off one by one and put them in a bag and spread them all over the floor, but I don't really mind. Oh no, I got those for somebody. <laughs> so y'all, um, I'm about to go up to the room now. And I'm about to go to the room now. Yes, I'm so excited, but I'm so nervous. Like I'm acting like it's my birthday, but I'm on the way to the room now. I'm about to get it together. I need to smoke, so I'm about to just chill out for a little while because I haven't talked to him ever since earlier when we first, when I first checked in with y'all, like way earlier. So I'm about to um go to the room. I'm about to chill for a little while. I'm about to show y'all everything that I got today. And then I'll probably um, start setting up and show y'all the process or probably show y'all once I'm finished. So stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below how you think his reaction going to be. Do you think Y'all, look at the view. This is when the sun is going down. It's so pretty. Like, I'm going to show y'all what it looks like when it's all the way nighttime. But it's so pretty, like this is such a vibe. So yeah, I'm about to um I'm about to um so y'all I'm about to get some of the stuff out, show y'all what I got what I got today, and then I'll start setting up decorating or whatever, and I'm gonna show y'all what it's looking like. Stay tuned. Comment down below if you think he is gonna like it or do you think he's gonna be like whatever or y'all comment down below and let me know. Okay, cause I'm nervous. Like I've never did anything like this before for no guy. I've never did anything like this before, period. So I'm just really nervous and I just hope everything goes well. I hope that it turns out cute. I hope that he likes it. So y'all stay tuned let's get into it <laughs> okay y'all so i'm back um i kind of just took off my clothes or whatever because like i started getting uncomfortable and i'm about to start setting up everything and what else i'm about to start setting up everything and i have this little outfit that i want to put on <laughs> y'all i'm back so i'm about to show y'all everything that i got from the stores today so from target um well y'all can see right here i just got those flowers so i just got those flowers from target and they are real flowers i got red blooms i got two packs of 15 count and i got like this little happy birthday sign that i'm gonna put on the um wall somewhere i gotta figure out where i got some tape and then i just grabbed these two little cute these two little cute glasses um, so i got those that's all i got from target um y'all did see me going for every 21 but it wasn't like nothing related to him or today um i just in walmart i got this mainstays island blossom candle it smells very, very good. And um, all today I got pink candles. It wasn't necessarily more for their color, but it was because of the smell. And they told me like, they were telling me which ones are like the best sellers, which ones smell the best. So I got this candle, Island Blossom. <laughs> yeah, it, sm it smells so good. And it was $3. The big one was $3, which is crazy because the other candle store, I'm gonna show you guys what I got from there. The other candle store, their candles were $10. Like, I should have went to Walmart in the beginning. And then I just got two packs of these. Two packs of these. And these are Mainstays tea lights. Basically tea light candles. And these are packs of 50. So, in total, I got 100. 
I felt like 100 was enough anyways. So I got a pack of 100 um, and I'll show y'all how to set it up. And then I just got a little card for him that I'm gonna write in it. So that's what I got from Walmart. And then from the mall, the candle store that I got, from the, oh, uh, the candle store is stuff that I got. So they, these little small candles were only $3. Right, so look, y'all. This was from Walmart, this was $3. This was from the candle store, this was $3. Like, what? Then, these ones from Walmart were $3 too. So I'm just like, what the fuck? And the big one that I have, I'm gonna open it up and show you guys. It's two different ones in here. So they're like, this is one and this is one. And these were $10 each. Like, what the fuck? So, um, let me open it up for you guys. I like that she wrapped them too, that was really nice. So I got two of these size candles and yes, they were $10 for this size, like what the hell. So these are wood wick candles. If you don't know what wood wick candles are, they're like, when you light them, they make like the fire crackling noise. And I really love these candles. They smell good, they burn a long time. And the wood, like the noise, it soothes me. Like it's very common, it's just, it's very relaxing, peaceful, everything. So the first one I got is Woodwick um, Coastal Sunset. It smells so good, guys. Coastal Sunset, that's what it looks like. And that's the top. This is the one that the lady at the store recommended to me. It smells so good. And the next flavor I got is Melon Blossom. This one is so good. It's more like a watermelon, like a fruity kind of thing. So it smells good. And then I have these tiny wicker candles and um, they're the same flavors too. These two are Coastal Sunset, like the one I just showed you. And these two are the same Melon Blossom, like the other one I just showed you. So um, I only got two different scents, but I just got, you know, small different sizes because y'all are going to see what I want and what I'm trying to do when I'm finished setting it up. So I got these. So yeah. Y'all, I really like that smell. And I love wood with candles, like, oh my gosh. And then I went to Spencer's today. And if y'all don't know what Spencer's is, let me just tell you what Spencer's is real quick. If y'all don't know what Spencer's is, Spencer's is like a edgy, I don't know. Cause like back then, like 2015, 2016, it was like a gothic store, like Hot Topic, if y'all know what Hot Topic is. And they started shutting them down. So Spencer's is like a Hot Topic. That's what, it's It's a version of Hot Topic. But um, but this is a little coupon book for him. Like, <laughs> I wanna know if he gonna use it. I wanna see if he gonna use it, so. And then I got some Doc Johnson Good Hill Tingle Spray for the Ultimate Oral Sex. And I got it in watermelon flavor. So it's the Good Hill Tingle Spray and watermelon flavor. Y'all, <laughs> I don't want y'all come for me in the comments like, you freaky girl. You... Nah, I just, I literally have not done anything like this before. Never did anything like this before. Um, This is just all for him and his birthday. So the next thing I got is Feather Love. And I'm going to open it up and show you guys in a second when I start decorating the room. But yeah, just some handcuffs. And then I got a candy G string. That's it. A candy G string. <laughs> Y'all, that's everything that I got from the stores today from all my little running around or whatnot. So. I'm about to get started setting this stuff up and I will see you guys in a minute. Please bear with me because it's just a lot going on. I feel rushed. I got a lot of things that I have to do. Just, you know, a lot of running around. So y'all probably like, where are you going now? <laughs> 
So y'all, okay. I did forget the speaker and that's what I really, really wanted because I want to play music and I don't want to play music off my phone, like what? So y'all, I changed my clothes. So I just threw on a big white t-shirt. Um, I have not been updating on y'all the time all day long. So right now it's 9.30, so um, I'm on my way down. I did not call an Uber or nothing because I just called CVS and CVS is right in the corner. So I'm gonna just walk over there and I'm about to get um, a speaker for $10. Just a little bullshit speaker. So that's what I'm doing. Um, what else do I think I need while I'm out? I don't think I need nothing else. So I don't think I need nothing else. So we got that, um, and then I got the chocolate. So I feel like it'll go good with the chocolate. So right now I'm about to just, everything's laid out right here. I'm about to just start putting stuff together, figure out how I'm gonna do what. And then I'm gonna just show y'all along the way or probably let y'all see and yeah. Stay tuned y'all. Bitch, I'm a big fan store. I turn around with this Marlo. Coke, I ain't a slango. Hunted up and just saw it all. Surrounded by the angels. Diamonds on when I'm talking low. She won't be my nigga. But I'm afraid to fall in the so hell. I'm just putting up the sign. Um, That's where I figured I wanted the sign to be. I might move it down lower. I don't know, y'all. It's all a work in progress. Like, this is so frustrating. I think I'm gonna take it down and move it like right here or lower. Cause it's not it's not giving what it needs to give, y'all. It's not giving what it needs to give, so we're about to put it like right here. So y'all, 
I, I put this sign up. Look, I don't care how it looks. Y'all don't know how many times I done did it over. I'm a Virgo, I'm a perfectionist, but baby, it's just a sign. It ain't worth it. So I got two 15 count balloons. So I'm finna blow, literally blow 30 balloons up. And I'm gonna try to make them big, like probably big, really big and kind of like medium size. Oh, <sighs> so I don't have to do a lot, but I'm gonna show y'all the sign. So that's what it's looking like right now. I don't care. I really don't. <laughs> like, but yeah, I'm gonna just get the rest of the stuff together, guys. And she's currently blowing up the balloons. This is so frustrating, so exhausting. Like, Also, don't want any to pop so i'm not trying to make them too too big but i don't want them to be like small or medium and my nails i don't want them to break either this is too much like some gloves so i can finish doing that and i'll be back it's the struggle for me so listen guys i have on gloves <laughs> like y'all i've never um let me not lie but i just never had to do no shit like this i'm literally picking these motherfuckers off one by one y'all like y'all don't know how hard it is like I feel like I've already did so many and I haven't even did that many. Like, it's so hard. Like I literally have to pull them all off the root. And yeah, so right now um, I'm currently just pulling them off. Um, It's 11.15. I literally just got off the phone with Bay, and he said he was going to holla at, oh! And I keep flicking seeds everywhere. Um, but he told me he was going to go link up with one of his guys or whatever. And then he was going to be on his way. So that means I need to hurry up. Because he was like, oh, what are you doing? I was like, nothing. He was like, oh, you laying down? I said, yeah, I'm so tired. <laughs> so... I need to hurry up because the only thing I've got done so far is the freaking um, balloons. Like, I still have to do the flowers, the roses. I still have to make the bath water. And I still have to um, do the candles. And then, so, so y'all, I got on the phone with him. And I was like, what you do today? And he was like... Oh, I didn't really do nothing. I just got dressed like an hour ago. And I was like, what? Like all these hours, you just not getting dressed? And he was like, oh, I told you it ain't a big deal for me. Um, 
it's just like any other day, whatever, whatever. Like I have better days. He said, he said, I have better days when, um, you know, like when it ain't my birthday, like just some regular chill shit, I guess. So I was just like, oh, okay, okay. So I feel like he is definitely going to be surprised now. Like at first I was nervous. I'm nervous. Like it's my birthday. I'm waiting on surprise. But um, I feel like he's definitely going to be happy now. Um, I don't really know his actual reaction, but I feel like he's just going to appreciate it. And he's just, I don't know, because it's like I never seen him, you know, be mushy to me. Like he, he give me kisses and hugs and little stuff like that. But I never seen him actually simp. Matter of fact, you know what? That's a whole nother story. the next day um i haven't talked to bae since i told y'all last time i talked to him i just went down to the front desk to get a pen so i can write on the card that i got him um everything is already done everything is done decorated set up um i think oh my shoe came off i think the last thing i have to do is just light the candles i think that's it
day um it's like four o'clock in the afternoon i'm just now waking up like literally just now waking up um look at the aftermath <laughs> like so basically let me just fill you guys in on what happened so the last time i i talked to y'all or whatever um what did i say i said it was like 11 12 something he was on his way why didn't he never come like he came but he didn't come until like three o'clock in the morning so we got into a whole little argument or whatever and i just felt like really unappreciated how you say it i felt <coughs> shit Ugh, excuse me i felt unappreciated unappreciated i felt like that and i'm just like damn like y'all know i took y'all with me everywhere running around doing all of this so i put a lot of time a lot of thought and a lot of money into doing this into making it right and you couldn't even show up let alone show up on time so i'm just like i felt some type of way because this like i said was my first time doing something like this for anybody like ever and i just feel like he should have been more grateful i felt like he should have came when he said he was gonna come he shouldn't have had me waiting for hours and hours and then i ended up just getting lit by myself like i had started drinking i started smoking like i got lit by myself so by the time he was here like everything had kicked in the liquor had got me getting heated like i started getting so angry mind you he was already drunk and whatnot too and then he came here and started drinking too so we're both drunk or whatever we just we didn't really like get into a fight or argument we was just like exchanging words or whatever excuse me y'all I, I just woke up like and my allergies are bad but um we didn't like get into it or anything we just like started ex exchanging words and i just felt some type of way because i'm just like if i did all of this for you the least you could have did was show up like and he was like oh just leave everything like that i'll be back tomorrow whatever whatever and i'm like it's not even gonna feel the same like you know i talked to him at 10 11 o'clock yesterday night so i'm thinking okay he's gonna be here before 12 like that's the whole purpose of it being your birthday like you showed up at 3 3 30 in the morning the next day and it's not your birthday no more like i don't know y'all could you comment down below if you think that he was right or i was wrong or what do you guys think comment down below but i just honestly felt some type of way um he's been calling me like he called me three times early this morning so he got here at three o'clock in the morning we started drinking and smoking together whatever um we kind of rode around and then he's gonna say are you hungry at three o'clock in the morning like there's nothing open to eat at three o'clock in the morning mind you i spent all day doing this so when he came i was thinking we're gonna order food in, get in the jacuzzi whatever you know and just enjoy a chill little night or i was thinking that we were gonna get dressed up and go out because that's the that were the plans we just kept mentioning that so i don't know i don't know if i'm doing too much i don't know like i don't know i feel like i have a right to feel how i feel but at the same time like i don't think we're gonna get anywhere like so i don't know i just felt like i just felt like like when he walked in he was just like oh my god oh my god like you can tell that he was grateful but it's just like you really don't know like the struggle and the hassle that i had to go through today to get all this done for you and you couldn't even be on time like come on now his birthday you know i told you guys that earlier so i don't know now i just i don't know i just i'm just stuck like i just feel some type of way but i don't know i don't know if i should be acting a certain way to him i don't know if i should be upset like i'm upset with him because it's like he don't really know you know what i was doing for him like i feel like this was a lot this was the first thing i've ever done for anybody like i put a lot a lot of thought into this Every single time he called me and said, oh, I'm finna come. I'll be there in five minutes. 
and he never showed like i had to light these candles four times they kept going out kept going out like i tried to make when he finally got here um we didn't get back to the room and get situated and settled until about 3 34 o'clock in the morning like by then it, the sun is about to come up it's a whole new day so i was giving him the cold shoulder you know i showed you guys earlier that i had got um like little knickknacks and stuff and toys and games and stuff from spencer's so when he seen everything he was like oh yeah come on let's play with this let's get into it and i just was like it was just a whole turn off like it was just i wasn't even in the mood like i was honestly upset and me being drunk it just made it worse so i don't know y'all i just feel some type of way um when he got here he literally was like oh i spent the night with you i mean you came at three four o'clock in the morning and then you left at eight o'clock that's four hours four or five hours like you weren't here that long and i don't know y'all like i'm just really really upset like i'm just really upset i don't know what to think i don't know how to feel it's just like damn so when he left at eight o'clock um he called me he facetimed me three times when he left i didn't answer none of them and then he sent me like five text messages like oh don't worry about this don't worry about that um and just a whole bunch of other just mess like i didn't even read all of it um i turned my red receipts receipts off see when i read his messages but i was asleep as soon as he left i just slept all day like i had other shit to do like I have stuff to do like i was supposed to be meeting someone today for some um for some clothes for some products um that they had just released so i was supposed to be doing that i had a whole photo shoot yesterday and today that i missed um well i mean i guess it was my fault because i got drunk and overslept but yesterday i put all my time and thought into this so i missed that um i'm dealing something with my brother i was supposed to be sending him money and i bypassed that because i'm doing this like it's just so much i have going on but i stopped everything everything that i was doing i stopped for him to please him to make sure his birthday went right because he ended up this hotel is in his name because i'm not 21 so he was just texting me a whole bunch of things like oh you better be there when i get back um you better do this and do that and i was just like what the fuck what so i don't know y'all i don't know i don't know we gonna just i don't know because i honestly don't even like my my mood is just it's just really like fucked up like my mood is fucked up and i don't want you guys to be like oh you're doing the most you're being extra over you know this and this and that that's why i said if y'all feel like i'm doing the most let me know i'm doing the most because i know that i do the most i know that i want a lot of things to be perfect i'm a virgo so if y'all feel like i'm doing the most let me know down below if not let me know what you guys think about what happened um this is just gonna be my outro i'm gonna add it to my vlog of me getting everything together or whatever um i don't know if i want to update you guys because it's like i don't even want to talk to him see him anymore or nothing like that like i just i don't know i need to gather my thoughts but he sent me a text message and was like oh i'll give you your space if that's what you want and a whole bunch of other crazy things so i don't know y'all but I'm gonna just close out this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna be dropping a whole bunch of more stuff. Comment down below what kind of content do you guys wanna see. And I'm gonna see you in the next video.